Another email from James Bond. Yeah. Guess he needs us again. Yeah. Good job defeating those bad guys, 008 and 009. If you're reading this, it means you survived the training. Your next mission is to go on vacation to Rio for the 2016 Olympics. Ah, oh, nice. There are some suspects there. We need you guys to take them out. We also think there might be a rat in the agency, so watch your back. Good luck. You're going to need it. Signed, 007. Um, oh, no, there's a secret code in there. Oh, yeah. I see the red letters. letters. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. what does it say? G. G. O. O. T. Mm. Eight O. Oh. Uh, Go T. Yeah. H. Uh-huh. E. Uh-huh. A. Uh, yeah. S. Uh-huh. T. Uh-huh. O. Uh-huh. R. Yep. I. Yep. A. Mm. H. Mm. O. Mm. T. Mm -hmm. E. Mm -hmm. L. Go what to the Astoria Hotel. Uh, That's a nice one, Rhea. Remember that? Yeah. Cool. Let's go. Yeah. I'm so excited for our trip to Rio for the 2016 Olympics. Our flight leaves in two hours. We're going to need to pack food and water because they are necessary for life. Yeah, but I really want the VIP passes, but it's not necessary. I mean, they are very scarce because there are only ten left. Everybody wants them, so the supply is low. Maybe we should just go sightseeing instead. That's a tough choice. The trade-off for going sightseeing is that we won't get a VIP pass because we don't have time for both. The opportunity cost of going sightseeing is that we won't get to see and get autographs from all the famous athletes. You know, but there is an incentive on the VIP passes, but I'll get one 25% off. Oh. You know, I think we should do that. Yeah, that's and I idea. heard, I heard that if you get those VIP passes, you get memorabilia from the athletes. That's oh, a good. Oh, yeah. Goods, I like goods. Yeah. I'm glad their hotel has room service. They'll tend to our every need. Yeah, the, p the people provide a service to our room are a labor resource. You know there are other kinds too. Yeah. The hotel uses natural resources like wood, fresh spring water, to give us heat and nourishment. Cool. The hotel also uses capital resources, which are man-made like chairs and air conditioning, to make our trip more relaxing and comfortable. Wow, look at the Tom Newell Country Play in Rio. Oh, man. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain speaking. I want to welcome you aboard the Toyota Flight 007 service from Dulles to Rio de Janeiro. 
Once we get aboard today, our flight time will be 9 hours and 33 minutes. Currently in Rio, the winds are out of the south at 5 miles per hour. Bad visibility, clouds, and snow. The temperature is 0 degrees centigrade, that is about 32 degrees Fahrenheit. But once again, welcome aboard. The airplane company can't set the ticket price too high because of consumer sovereignty. Yeah, the competition between Toyota Air and BMW Air is high, but Toyota Air was much cheaper, so, you know, we're flying with them. Yeah. I'm glad BMW Air doesn't have a monopoly, though. I mean, on the airbase. Otherwise, James could have never afforded these tickets. Yeah. The airlines are making a profit because they are getting more money from the plane ticket costs than they are spending on the flight. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Mr. Toyota. On behalf of the rest of the flight crew and myself, I want to welcome you aboard Toyota Flight 007 service from Dulles to Rio de Janeiro. We are currently level at 33,000 feet. The route of the flight will take us over the ocean to Rio. Your captain assures me that we have a smooth flight ahead and that I can turn off the seatbelt sign. Please feel free to move about the cabin. I have just one special favor to ask, and that is, while you are in your seat, to please keep your seatbelt fastened snugly about you. In the meantime, please sit back, relax, and enjoy the flight. And once again, welcome aboard. Ladies and gentlemen, we are about to begin our final descent to Rio de Janeiro Airport. Currently at Rio, the weather is snowy. We have certainly enjoyed having you on board today. We hope to see you again real soon. And thanks again for flying Toyota Air. before they run out. Yeah. Hi, we would like two VIP passes, please. Wow, you guys are lucky. There are just two left. What's the price on those VIP passes again? The total price will be $900. Okay, here you go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Here you go. Put yeah. them on. more VIP passes. Yeah, we consume more than they produce. Yeah, but at least we got the last ones. Yeah. Let's go watch Michael Phelps win. The race is in 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, there they go. Away they go. The champion underwater. Up he comes, Phelps, and he's pretty much in front. At one, it's Kozanovsky, then it's Burmese to Shibata. Alongside Phelps on the other side, it's Wu Ping, Chen Yin, 
Sportscott and Grimioniakis is up there in lane number eight. Early leader in lane seven, perhaps, it'll be sports of. Finalist in Montreal and Athens. Phelps up there as well, turning in front of Kosanivsky and then sports of it for first under world record pace. Michael Phelps is out by two body lengths and he's leading the world record line behind. Surely this is going to be two in two nights. Look at him go! The champion, Michael Phelps, the swimming thoroughbred. He's got 20 metres to swim. He's still in front. He looks so good, so easy. Another world record, Michael Phelps. 150.209, can you believe? Go!